in our governing section, most representative leaders and politicians in history. Today, we are going to talk about the Buddha. Who was this religious leader, considered a god for Buddhism, which is one of the largest religions of the world, along with Catholicism, Hinduism, and Islam. Buddhists follow the teachings of the Buddha, originally known as Siddhartha Gautama, who teaches the path to liberation from suffering and the cycle of birth and death. In the year 563 BC, in the kingdom of Sakya, in Asia, Siddhartha Gautama is born in the south of what is now known as Nepal. A dream of his mother announced, according to the wise man, the arrival of an extraordinary being that would rise to perfection like a humble monk. Ten months later Siddhartha Gautama would be born within an aristocratic family in the now defunct Sakya Republic. From the age of seven he expressed surprising aptitudes in wisdom and piety. At the age of 29, Siddhartha abandoned all his wealth and wearing a yellow tunic, he dedicated himself to traveling the world as a monk. He preached about the transmigration of the soul after death towards creature sugar or lore. According to behavior observed during life, Buddha, the enlightened one stated that, to obtain the liberation of conscious existence, man must follow the path of eight virtues, related to his righteousness in various aspects of your life. 1. Righteousness in faith. 2. Righteousness of intention. 3. Righteousness in speaking. 4. Righteous conduct. 5. Righteousness in life. 6. Righteousness in effort. 7. Righteousness in thinking. And last but not least. 8. Righteousness in meditation. A curious fact is that, Buddha himself to need the existence of any god, but he himself has become considered a god in the Buddhist religion. Siddhartha Gautama dies at the age of 80. Of the total world population, 6.9% practice Buddhism, representing 500 million believers. Thank you for staying until the end of this video. If you liked it, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like it and activate the notification bell to notify you when we publish new content. Goodbye.